Okay. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's all things African Nana here. As usual, I've told you guys that I'm Mama Plugs. I take you to places where you can buy good quality products at good <laughs> price. So I'm at Kariako, where I normally buy the Maasai sandals, both for women and men. They sell both at wholesale and retail prices. They like have everything. So let me show you. Sante. So they have the bags here. Akona Hizo, they have sandals ranging from 500 up to 2000, depending on the quality. But the more you get, the more when you buy many pieces, that's why you get at wholesale price. No Hizo. So I'm trying to choose for someone. I'm supposed to transport them to Mali. To me, fika Mali. To look South Africa, say to come Mali. Where? Who just opened the gate? And this one, this design. Then this one. I am very good. Almost I'm here. Orina Orina and Sequenda Mali. So I am your sheet. Sasa alafu nda kuambia size, si ndio? Niko hapa kwa Tony tena. Huh? Welcome Kariako Market. Uh, selling wholesale and retail, si ndio? Selling wholesale and retail. Mm. Good sandals, mm. leather, high quality. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, so this is where they have men shoes. So these are men those go pass on the sun. Thirty pairs of shoes. So that's what I've decided on. But I'm going home so that I show you guys what I've bought and the prices of each. Because I told you each shoe has its own price depending on the quality and depending depending on depending on the designs with the beads. Guys, hey, <laughs> so uh, uh, you know, yesterday I had gone to two places, Isili and Kariako. Isili, there's a lady who sent me, sir. she wanted to gift her mother. So there were some dresses I, I was looking at. She wanted specifically a buy for the mother tacky dresses, but they were so damn expensive. So I couldn't buy. I, I wanted to reach out the lady first so that I tell her what was happening. So after that, I went to Kariako. Hey. Do you know Nilitoka Kariako around? Let me tell you, this hassle errands is not a joke. That's why we charge respect people who do errands for you guys. Hey, sim chezo. So cause uh I think I I left at Kariako at around 4 p.m. and I came home. And this is okay. I didn't need indoms got here 25 kg. These are 30 pairs of shoes. I want to show you. And the video you see where I buy. I normally buy at Rose. If you want, I'll give you the number so you can go and buy there. But also, you can send me because you know normally I have my price. Kuna bay or when I buy things, cause I normally buy a lot of things from them. So the guys, we are. I am telling you, we have gone 
global let me tell you i'm so happy you should be happy for your girl but first first of all let me tell you to make sure that you put your post notification bells on so when i post a video it alerts you and support my channel by watching my videos from the startup to the end or either you can support me to do your concierge service this video is the concierge service is me running errands of course at a fee and i've been telling you the good thing with me i am very very affordable so this lady she contacted me in email she wanted my number i gave her my number she texted me she is from canada but her origin is from mali so she wanted to give me a business opportunity to go to good business opportunity she, she was inquiring about Maasai sandals both men and female and also earrings the bracelets and all that she wanted to uh to start selling she has a shop in mali to mefika mali my dear in mali she wants to as uh, she has a shop in mali so she wants to sell these things and remember i am that plug let me tell you i can tell you where to buy but also i'm the best person you can send because now i have a business relationship with the vendors most of the vendors so they know what to sell to me i normally tell people afadhali mimi nikule kidogo kidogo but nipate biashara ya watu so when i go and buy these things i normally don't at the exceed price i normally tell people just pay me for going because she i wanted to know if i'm the one who sells the shoes so i told her i don't sell but i i do errands for people i go and shop for people and then that's where i come in people pay me because of me shopping for them so she told me how much i charge i normally charge 10 percent of the total cost by the way guys that's what i i charge but if you feel it's expensive we can always talk because when you make it to a hundred thousand ten percent of that you know how much it is so she told me it's okay i go and uh, she sends she sent me some samples of the Maasai sandals she wanted i told her the prices because right now the prices are here on my mind that's why i'm telling you i have a good business relationship with the vendors so she told me uh, i also told her before um, that that's how i, I advise my clients before i go and start buying for you these shoes let me go and inquire first shipping companies that will bring things to mali at a cheaper price so i went to three companies that is ups the one that is in hilton another one is DH dhl and another one is there's another company that is at uh, diamond plaza because of course i have a shipping company there's this guy who normally takes uh, things from sumona mini menda south africa niko malawi i also sent some things to cameroon even rwanda have sent by the way guys and even us like we are global you can even attest it but before i continue with this video guys please tell me which company that can that delivers things to mali at a good price I have one guy, the one who goes to south, so he doesn't go to to west. Mali is in the west side, West Africa, so he doesn't go to that side. So after comparing the three companies, I saw that DHL is better. But before I to, I I advised, I sent this in, in a WhatsApp message to this lady, and I told her I've gone to three companies and I'm seeing that DHL is much better. So DHL, when I went to DHL, they said between five to ten kgs, they'll charge they charge me nineteen thousand Kenyan shillings. So after all that, this lady told me the sizes. After I told her. DHL and even she saw that DHL is better and she was in need of these sandals uh, She sent me the number of shoes she wanted. So we have 30 pairs of shoes here sandals 10 pairs men different designs and 20 ladies different design with different sizes and of course she told me the number of earrings she wanted so we did so we did the transaction that's how, what how I do business with my clients They send me all the money because she sent me a uh, money including my fees so that i do the including the shipping so she said she sent me all the money of the shoes money my fees and also um, shipping money of which that's okay that's how i do she trusted me because you don't trust anybody just do and do it yourself but if you trust somebody you just because me i wouldn't want to tarnish my name or tarnish my brand because this is the business that i've been wanting to do i remember this is my sister and another friend of mine who is called joanne 
who advised me because nana you love shopping so you just make it as a business monetize because you can't fully depend on youtube you have to have another hustle so that at least you pay your bills so she sent all, she sent she sent me all the money so i went yesterday at carrier co so let me show you the designs we are bought for men for men there are three designs and let me tell you the the reason why i love going to that shop that guy uh advised me the shoes that will go sana so there are three designs so there's this one i hope you're able to see kunahi you see it has a ring here but you just put your finger here, your goomba. So this is one design. I hope you are able to spot the difference. And this is another design. Like a slipper like this, another design. You see, we bought 10 pairs in another design here. hivi, guys. Yeah, like this, so that mweze kuona. So there's another design. There were three. And then there's this other one, pia near ring, but it's on a two strands. You see, so this is another design I bought. So we bought three designs, three different designs. I need to show you again. Three different designs for men. No easy upper. Guys, I hope you are able to, to see the designs that are really, 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 really different. Mumona. So we bought 10 pairs. If you want to know about the price, guys, just DM me on my email address. It's going to be there on the description box below. And also, I'm going to put my number down there. So, let me show you the type of shoes we bought for ladies. Of course, we bought different designs. She had sent me some designs. So, I made sure that most of the designs that she had sent me, they are there. You know, of course, this Masai Sandals and Apatanga, the designs, most of them are, are the same. So, I made sure the, the same designs are here. So I bought this one for this is for ladies guys. You're able to see in your lady. This was 800. Let me just tell you the price. Also, this is for lady. Mona. This is actually this that guy told me this is the latest design. So I told him first, give me the latest designs and also make sure that the design this lady has sent me, they are also there. To make up me, I make sure that my clients are very satisfied, by the way. So do he design in Guinea. My camera, I need to buy. I can watch videos. I want to buy tripod. And guys, I'm taking them to DHL tomorrow. So I'm going to, to film how I take them. Also, there's this design. The, I think the, the why they are pricing different is because of the design and also the, the beadwork, actually. The beadwork. The beadwork. They, it's told me because of the beadwork. That's why. No, no, just tell me that the sandals are cheap. So, kuna he. And also there is this one. Wow. Look at this. Look at the flower. Wow. Look at it. Look at it. Different sizes, different designs. Look at this. Wow. Mona. Wow. I just want to show you guys what is in store. When you send me, I make sure that I bring to you quality things. Like you'll never be disappointed. I can, even even what I can screenshot, I can attest to that. There are many testimonies. People love my job. Mona. Eh? Nana, eh, I'm a, should take, I, could, I should change my TikTok. Eh, Nana, the errant girl. Look at this also. Mwangale Mawa. And the quality is really, really, really nice. Ni leather. Yani haishi. Let me tell you the secret of these shoes. Kama utaki ishi araka. Izeke araka. Number one, usizieke kwa jua. Don't put it in direct sunlight. Number two, don't wash with water. Tiglo no janga kiatu unasugua mbaka na maji na sabuni. No, just wipe. That's how you have a long lasting shoes. Because me, I've been buying shoes from that, this particular vendor. And mine have stayed. So ndo hii. Kariyeko unajua unazenda malipengu uka, uka, uka oshua the design ya viatu. <laughs> At a design type of yet so there's this design so i remember this is hey this is hot cake certain lady came there she wanted to kuchukua iki yato. i told her just leave that, those shoes because it was the only one remaining like it is the demand of these shoes is high this design this design this type of shoe the demand is so high guys oh, 
they size 39 and they size 38 because someone will will love this designer say me hey I want, is there a bigger one so there's this bigger size which is 39 let me put this design i told her i have this design like i really love this shoe this shoe is really nice number this shoe is really really nice this design is really really nice look at it i have this exactly shoe and it has never never disappointed me i know you saw in my other video so i have this type of shoe look at the color combination like you can wear with everything somebody said that it's very busy it's not busy it's not busy it's how you wear it so this also this one i was so skeptical of taking this design there's a certain nigerian let me tell you hey, if you want you can even date apokaliako many different countries uh, people from different countries are normally there on weekends buying things like people have discovered Kaviako. I don't know how they discovered it because many people used to buy things at Masai Market in town and no, they normally shift. So the same same people from Masai Market no anakujango anakuja kuchukua vitu Kaviako and then they sell at Masai Market and then they but it's business. Somebody is, may, may, might be tired that I kufika Kaviako market or somebody might be tired doesn't want to go to either Masai market or Kariako. that's why i come in i run your errands at the comfort of your home at the comfort of your office at the comfort of your country whatever place you are that's why i come in errands by nana so i was so skeptical of buying this design but that lady told me this is a very unique design i should take it me i saw it as very boring because it has icona color combination your cream brown and black i just took it because it's not for, for wearing people have different tastes maybe somewhat somebody can love this and there's also this design guys this one is also trendy it's really nice kunahi there's also black one most of the designs are the ones that were in her photo on the photo she sent me no no different sizes each shoe has a like easy mingi ni mekuonyesha they are 800 guys eh mwona this design so there is this also oh i showed you this one was i showed you this number 38 and number 40 this one i the guy told me that this is trending like i love the color combination of these shoes and also this one nilikuwa nimechukua nilichukua size that tofauti by the way 41 40 and 39 yeah this shoes this shoes really nice e aki siju kama mnaweza ona beautiness of this shoe vile mimi naona beauty i don't know and also this one you see this nona maua i made sure i took different designs and also there is this like a gladiator mona so this this so this is a thousand this is uh, uh, this is 1200 and also this is 1200 i'm about to see so i spent a total of twenty-eight thousand three hundred kenyan shillings let me also show you the earrings Let me show you the earrings, guys. There is here are the earrings. Are you see? see that those are the earrings. You wanted five samples. So what I did, I akini likosa they had already finished. I'm telling you, apo ni malu neza penda kutaka kude to tapata wa nome apo. Hatani wacha nuez. Kud dating si no normal letter dating site. People say that you can get your other half kwa dating site, churches funerals at functions weddings and all that but also so this this other type here and also i bought five she wanted five to be precise johi ngine five and johi ngine hapa i bought five of them Alafu hizi blue ndo hizi pia. By the way ni hizi earrings kabisa ndo it. Even this one. So there are five. 
So I finished my work at around 5 p.m. So I'm supposed to go to DHL tomorrow. Let me tell you, the minute I finished buying all this, I told the guy to go and make sure that uh, he has weighed for me so that we know how much, how many kgs they were. I remember I told I have told you that between five to ten kgs at uh, in any DHL is nineteen thousand. So this one it was twelve point zero twelve point five. That is and uh, it has uh, exceeded by two point five kgs. So I really need to go to DHL tomorrow. I see how much they are going to charge me so that I tell the lady. So I told me I love communicating. Before all that, I made sure I told the lady that I'm going to take deliver these items to, on Monday to DHL, but they have exceeded. So we will see how much they will charge me so that I communicate with her. So, guys, without further ado, let me end this video. But it will be a continuation tomorrow. I hope I'll just use my phone. I hope they they will they will allow me to film inside the DHL Kozneda in Yikokwa International Life House. That's why I really love going guys. So I'll show you how much they charge me so bad. So this will be at Nimingi. Those are 10 and these are 20 pairs. So I'm heading to International Life International House to DHL so that I can send the package. Uh, let me show you where. Eh? So there is the shipment receipt guys the way bill number is the same as uh, the tracking number and you've seen i sent yesterday and they said estimated delivery date will be tuesday 24th september by end of day and here is the price so and you're here i went to dhl because it's the trusted guys but there on the comment section tell me which shipping company is the cheapest and trusted